So a while ago, I released this machine. It's a three-way that can follow lines uh, going to the right direction. So you can create arbitrary shapes with this TNT duping on every block twice. It's pretty useful for circles or stars or fish shapes. I'll demonstrate that. Uh, so this is the new one. It's for 1.15 and later, it's got the 1.13 duper. When you clone or schematic this, make sure to include all the chests. Because if you don't include the chests, especially ones in front of sticky pistons, it's probably going to break itself. Let me clone this over. Okay. Let me add a minecart. Minecart, minecart. We're going to use a, go ahead and use a furnace one just so it has more friction or whatever. I don't think it's necessary, but I use it always on my dupers. So to activate this, it starts with the little two-way. The two-way duper updated for 1.13. You're going to need silk touch and a coral fan. Lots of nice destruction. It's going to come up here, and this station is going to move that way one block. Okay, so the whole interesting, the whole point, the pitch of this whole thing is that when this observer hits this block, it's going to trigger this lamp, going to trigger this observer, and that's going to trigger this sticky piston, moving this whole thing that way one block, the station. So we're going to see that. Real nice. And this uh, two-way is already out of here by the time this moves over. So even if we have like a couple blocks like this, it's still going to work fine. And I think like as long as this is far enough away so this doesn't come back and crash into it, you can make uh, lines like this pretty much as long as you want. Especially like at the end of a circle when this thing is out of commission in any way, so it doesn't matter if it's going to crash. Alright, let me stop this just by breaking some slime. Okay. And now for the big use case of this thing is the circle. Everyone likes the big fancy circle perimeter. One hundred. This is 128. It's just smaller so it's faster to go. Uh, let me break all these chests, add the minecart, and more chests, that one. Okay, that looks good. And it's off. Uh, probably one of the biggest uses for the honey and slime was right here. Because getting a uh, getting two diagonal extensions in 12 blocks is really tricky, and I really struggled that uh, before the slime honey blocks. But right now, I could just make this and save only have two observers uh, or one observer, one redstone block, trigger all four pistons, and I can have this honey and slime right on top of each other. So, this right here is like. I experimented a lot with things like this and found that this one was the best for the situation for a double diagonal extension. And we just get honey, this slime structure to continue this one. This is also compacted a lot from the 1.12 version. I think this is a little bit smaller. Yeah, we got honey slime right here. Okay, I'm just waiting for this to come back. So you can see this. Oh, it's not going to happen. Oh. Well. Fine, let's see that slick. Oh, yeah. All right. Uh, one thing is this won't create a perfect circle because the border is perfectly circular. Uh, note that the TNT only goes like a uh, couple, like 10 blocks or something away. 
from the side from like where the duper starts in the schematic to uh the ridge it's not it, it's not the tnt doesn't dupe right here like it does on the other rim so it really what you have to do if you want a perfect circle is you have to divide your rails up into the two-way and the three-way side and then shift the three-way side like 10 blocks and it's tnt nothing's precise If you really want a perfect circle, you're still going to have to build a whole ton. Uh, this glazed terracotta over here. This is necessary because this has a lot of exposed slime, especially this block right here and these blocks right here. So the railing, either just make it all out of obsidian or glazed terracotta, or you can just make uh, when it's steep. And when I say steep, I just mean like a long, big change in a uh, length that the 2A has to go. Like these two, two, three, three. These are all glazed terracotta. I didn't bother with this because the station's gonna crash anyway over here. Uh, it dupes twice on every block. I don't think that's quite enough to get all the way down to Y0. So you're probably going to have to do a run, clean up liquids, bring the whole thing down and do a run. Or just mine for diamonds, doing the bar bottom. So yeah, the world download link is going to be in the, the description. Hope you have fun, find this useful. Make big long diagonal trenches, make big long slightly off diagonal trenches, uh, really anything as long as the station doesn't have to make a left.